So if you don't have any coding experience, but you want to create a website for your business, for yourself, to have online presence, you're in luck. So thankfully, the website builders make it easier to make awesome looking site without knowing how to code, right? So I'm gonna count down the absolute best top five pros and cons of each website's builders that you can use. So let's dive right in. So starting off our countdown, coming at number five is Gator Website Builder. So it's from the folks at HostGator, well-known web hosting service, which reviews you know, various sites or you can host your website there. So it's easier to use, drag and drop website builder, has a good amount of features and a little bit of expensive, but good choice for small businesses, gets your site up and running. It includes e-commerce tools, easily set up online stores, tools to help you create a logo, more than 200 customizable templates and custom domains, and a SSL certificate and free hosting as well, or cheaper hosting, right? Gator Builder e-commerce capabilities are unlimited. You can create a blog, you can create an e-commerce store, and it offers a free plan, but it gives you 30 day money back guarantee if it doesn't work out for you, right? So hosting and custom domain is also included. So it appeals to those of you who are looking at one stop solution. Okay. Number four pick is you may have heard of, it's called Weebly, right? From its e commerce by Square. So it's one of the best drag and drop editors that helps you create an online store's feature pack. Now, some of the features include photo editor, video backgrounds, and catalogs, right? So also it's a key, has the ability to switch anytime without having to rebuild the entire site. In addition to those of you who focus on e-commerce, customizable email templates are available, help you, you know, discover in search engines because that's a pretty powerful element within Weebly, right? And makes shipping easier, includes inventory management tools as well. Now they do offer a free plan, which is quite generous, but it doesn't allow you to connect a custom domain and limits you 500 megabytes per store. So if you want to use your own domain, you can, of course, pay a little fee, $6 or something per month, and have unlimited storage and have free custom domain. And those start, you know, plans start at $12 a month, right? So coming in number three is at GoDaddy, primarily known as a custom domain name. For example, it has its very own website builder, very popular, more than 21 million users. You can set up a website very, very efficiently and very easily right here using GoDaddy, right? Right on PC or mobile, tons and tons of customization options are available with GoDaddy Website Builder. From online store, you know, it optimizes it, you know, your site and search engines. It helps you market your site. So it also has excellent 24-7 support, which is included in the free plan. But of course, if you take the pro plan, then of course, additional features such as advanced e-commerce tools, being able to connect custom domains. And of course, all plans have a seven day free trial. You can try it out risk-free and then go from there. Now, before I get to my top other two picks, there are other website builders as well, right? For example, wordpress.com, which is fairly, fairly popular. It's a hosting service that you can actually use to just host your blog, right? Or a website. So thousands of easy to use add-ons, free templates, great functionality, easy to use. It's best for beginners, right? So you can build a site, you can you know, do e-commerce, you can start a blog and much more with WordPress. So the other one is called Jimdo, right? It's designers, photographers, you can build a home online and allows your customers to find you. It has all the digital tools that you would actually need for a website. Plans include all the basic features, you know, at say two gigabytes of bandwidth per month for additional features, of course. You can have a free domain. Plans start at about $9 a month. And the strangest thing is really is how the specialized features of Jimdo actually helps, right? So there's no transaction fee. Uh, you can take payments via PayPal or Stripe, which is fairly popular, and all the tools. And, the, you know, let's let's take a look at the next, back to the countdown. Number two is, let's see, Squarespace, where is it? Right, boom, there it is. So everything you need to sell anytime. This is very, very popular as well, okay? So a good number of templates available, 
dozens of categories you can grow your business online without any hassle so if you're planning a sell online it has all the tools to actually help you set up your own store now built-in SEO tool is a great feature with Squarespace so it doesn't operate free tier but it gives you a free trial right so you can create a website e-commerce made easy and then market your business fairly simple and square all right top spot coming in number one best website is wix.com there you go so it allows you to create a website without limits now no other competitor can match the features that wix has so if you feel comfortable using web design it offers a crazy amount of templates that you can actually use so there are more than 900 templates that you can choose all of which are highly customized with e-commerce they have all the features as i've mentioned previously and a lot more so you can sell your products more efficiently it does offer a free plan but the limitations of course exist right you can attach a custom domain there's a limit of 500 megabytes and bandwidth as well so for additional features in a free domain a free tier the plan start at about 16 17 dollars a month which is not bad and of course they give you the money back guarantee as well if you're not satisfied so these are the sites that i have and one of the things um, that i want to just recap here is band zoogle right this is also a great site where you can build a stunning website and your e-commerce store where it has made the entire management of your website fairly fairly easy and simple okay now among all these sites that i've mentioned here that you can use these are the top sites right but how do you actually go about learning how to build and taking a look at these features more or less all these sites offer the same criteria same availability of features templates uh, whether it's for e-commerce store whether it's, it's blog and whatnot right but the idea is that whichever uh, you know the builder suits you based on the features that you're looking for and there's a key because of course they all look the same right they have all the features perhaps but there's always a little bit of catch that um, one website builder doesn't have as opposed to when you start comparing and try to pick the best one that suits your specific needs so understand first before you actually start picking up any one of these take a look at you know really what your project or your business is all about if you're a retail shop maybe you're comfortable with let's say a squarespace right if you are let's say a um, huge conglomerate or big shopping center or retail then maybe godaddy is good for you okay if you're just starting off and you, you know you're pretty much crunched on funds then you may want to use uh, let's say wordpress or wix right so once again all of these are fantastic but just kind of go through uh, of based on your own requirements and if you need to have uh, you know you need to learn how to do this of course then we have our claydesk technology skills platform just go to claydesk.com and then here you're going to find tons and tons of all these courses that you can actually take and then become proficient in all of these tools and start creating whether you want to be a software developer web developer front-end developer back-end or you know obtain technical skills we have everything right here on claydesk all right thanks for watching let me know in comments which you know, website builder you think is the best and you currently use if you are using let me know in comments thanks for watching i'll see you guys next time